We're working on a new app. Here's the mobile part. And here's the web part. Now the web part doesn't really consist of anything except this admin dashboard that I added via a package. But you can see it's showing the collections, showing the counts of documents in those collections. And those are the documents that we're seeing that you know powering this web app that's that data. Now when I go to uh, say add an activity via this dashboard here, click edit to update or go new to add the new activity, you'll see nothing's happening and the reason for that is this is using autoform to produce or create those new activities and autoform uses simple schema and when I was hacking up that little mobile app that you saw a moment ago um, I didn't put any simple schema in my, act uh, my collections look like this so here's where you'd normally write something like var activities schema equals new simple schema and start writing your schema now I'm getting bored already doing this so what I'm going to do instead is go back to uh, here, open a dev console and click on the schema tab pick out the activities collection here and press generate and what's happened there is I've just generated a schema based on the data in the database those four activities there now I can copy that, control C and control V, and paste that in right there. And you'll see it's put the thing there and it's attached it to my activities, uh, activities collection for me, all that sort of thing. So I'll press save, go back here, just wait for that to update. While we're waiting to update, just make a note that uh, what that schema was based on was just the four activities that are currently um, subscribed to, so what's in the client. If I wanted more uh, data to base that schema on, then I'd press auto-publish there. And now I've got, you can't see it probably, but I've got nine activities, and if I generated the schema again, there's actually one extra field that shows up. It's a field that I didn't want, it's just rubbish data from when I was developing. Anyway, auto publish off. Um, at this stage, what we should have if we uh, refresh the browser, I don't know why it hasn't auto refreshed itself, is we should have this. Now when we go to create a new activity, we've got all that stuff that was in the schema reflected through auto form. And it's just saved me a bunch of typing. And if I go and do the same thing for few other collections and yeah it saved me a few minutes of typing out schema nice little feature thanks